If you would like to support the channel, then please turn off adblock and refresh the page. Alternatively, use the link in the description below to donate to T1 Patreon. Thank you. Hello everybody, T1 Glistener Elf here. Going to be playing some more Arena. Today is the day that I'm going to be playing Michael1916. Later on though, that'll be this evening. And so what I'm doing is I'm trying to grind as best I can for just a few more wild cards to try to optimize my really bad deck <laughs> before he, before I get a chance to jam against him. Now, I'm supposed to play 25 lands and 40 lands. Ta-da! I, I could play anything, of course, to do this, but I'm going to try out some Karn Mud. I'm going to run the black version of the list. This is what I'll be playing against him. Maybe not this particular build of it, but this... Archetype, Mud, is what I'm going to be playing against him this evening, so I might want to jam some practice. That seems good. The list is still suboptimal because if I don't find some cards from packs, if I don't open packs in a bit uh, that happen to have those cards, I'll just burn some wild cards on him. It's alright. Well, it's not alright. Hey, there it goes. By the way, what's not alright is my screen still being black. Let's actually, let's see if it'll let me cancel. It never, let, nope, it's not doing it. I hit cancel, it's going to just keep it here until it says ready. Um, <laughs> oh well, we won't get it this one, but if you wait till after, see, called it. If you wait till after game one, <laughs> MTG Arena is broken, cancel doesn't work. Uh, if you wait till after game one, then I will have some packs to open. Speaking of packs, if you'd like to get anything from TCG, uh, use my link down in the description below. I will keep this hand, this looks fine enough. Uh, link down in the description below to try to, you know, if you purchase through TCG using that affiliate link, it actually does end up helping out the channel, so. Ooh, incubation. I'm also, as you can see by the, the logo here, I'm on Team Etherhub. So, we don't have anything to do yet, but we're gonna bluff. I very much like that I'm playing against Merfolk, so, uh, we're gonna pretend that we, okay, cool. Alright, hold up full control, make it seem like I might have something to do. Maybe. Alright. Yeah, th this murder in hand is going to come in handy. Yeah, murder into Raska's Contempt uh, into Eldest Reborn seems kind of brutal for Merfolk. Alright, let it resolve. Might as well keep the same one revealed. Why not? Alright. Here we go. Whoa, that took so long. That took so long, folks. Alright, well, if we happen to have Zal Zalfron Void, we could scry and then draw, but instead we're just going to draw. Oh, you know what? I haven't said hello to my opponent. There's Zalfron Void, right on time. You know, we actually don't have the second black, and that's, that's a little bit concerning. A little bit concerning. One of the issues with this deck is having that double black. Um... Oh, taking it. Yeah, it makes sense to do... Hey, got there. It makes sense to do the deep root here first, because you get more long-term gains. And it looks like I'm a pretty uninteractive deck. I just played a guild globe. So I don't blame them for trying out the deep root first. I'm just going to murder it here and now, so that they can't cast Mistbinder and get a trigger out of it. Uh, okay, so now we're now we're cooking. Now we're in business. I, I can still lose, but I anticipate not losing. I hope I don't. Branch Walker, yep, that makes sense. Alright, what you got? Branch Walker into land into Mistbinder? No, okay. Well, in that case... Hmm... I'm at 16. Do I want to try to stem the bleeding now and keep the Mistbinder up? I think I'm supposed to. I think, honestly, that I'm supposed to do that. So we'll play the Zalfron Void first. No matter what, we're going to do the Void. Karn Scion. Okay, that's fine. That makes creatures. And creatures, I hear, are okay. Now... Yeah, I see that. I see that. Oh, you know what? No, 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 it's fine, it's fine. I will hold it up for combat, and then I'll do it. If I'm going to do it anyway, I might as well get the timing right. 
Miss Binder's good. All right. Let's do some math, folks. We're gonna take five, or we hit. Okay, so if we hit the Miss Binder, we're going only gonna take five. If we hit the Branch Walker, we take three and then five. Uh, they've they've not hit land, so they're they're creature heavy here. So I think it makes more sense to hit the Miss Binder. Um, pass two attacks. Alright, what you got? What you got, opponent? Like, they, they have to know. They have to know. Alright. So it feels like I'm taking five. I'm actually gaining two, so... I'm taking three, effectively. Net three. Oh, by the way, the drink today is just water. Just plain old water. Uh, I'm not feeling super hot. Okay. So, land into Eldest Reborn. And that's to be expected. So if I play the Karn and make a artifact, it's just gonna eat one of them anyway. If I can hit a land here, I can go Guild Globe into Karn, and that'll make a 3-3, which seems relevant. All right, make him discard. We're actually cutting it pretty close here. We are <laughs> cutting it pretty close. Um, Ritual of Soot would be really nice. As it is, though, uh, we're not there yet. We are not there yet. So we're gonna scry, see what we can hit. Karn. Oh, hello. Sorry, bud. Alright, well... I could also have just made a hard read. No, 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 that's fine. Alright, so Karn. Make a dude, buddy. Yeah, this thing can't be blocked. And granted, I'm glad that they don't have as many cards in hand, but that's still... that's rough. That is rough. Okay. Ooh, is that another one? Yeah, that's another one. Ooh, folks, we are... are we dead? Yeah, we're, we're real close to it, folks. We have to block the Branch Walker, and we're dead next turn. If there were some sort of ensnaring bridge-ish effect in the format, we could maybe work our way out. But as it is, nothing I can get here is going to do the job, unfortunately. Absolutely nothing I can get here. So I'm going to have to give him the good game. This is just draw a card, so that's a thing, at least. I'll tell you what, tell you what. No... It, we can still do it. We can still do it. So we'll play Silvergill, draw a card, Ritual of Soot. Ritual of Soot. Oh, no. No. Not like this. Okay, wait, wait, wait. We're not dead yet still. We're still not dead yet. Zelfrin Void. Murder. Alright. Uh, you know what? Instead of... Instead of using Bag of Holding, draw, discard, I can just do this. Oh crap, which one did I tap? Okay, good. Uh, that's not good. So if I tap this last one, no matter what, I won't have the mana. Ah, uh, you know what? We'll give him the good game. We'll give him the good game. You got me. You got me, opponent. Oh, you're so close. So Ritual of Soot is a one of in this deck. And that would have been nice, but... Even with all that removal, we still couldn't stop, we couldn't uh, stall the game quite long enough. I mean, you know, there's a reason this deck isn't great. Merfolk is not the fastest clock in the format, and we still couldn't slow it down. Ay ay ay. I know, suboptimal version of the deck and all, but still, it mm, still feels like it should have done better than that. You know. All right, so, uh, sure, this seems bad. Let's go for it. <laughs> well, 
Watch it be Murpho. Watch it be Murpho. No, I don't think so. We will reveal to them that we just top decked a land. I should have held full control again. Murfolk, Murfolk, Murfolk. Nope. Okay. Alright. What you got? Cool. Watch this be the flash deck then. Uh, flash is. I don't know what I think about the flash deck in this matchup. Hmm. Trickster. This feels wrong, but they didn't play another land. I'm trying to so what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to run their counter spells out. Um if I can. That doesn't look like it's going to happen though. So I see manipulator, if I can get it to stick, seems really good in this match. There is no chance it's resolving though. But it's okay bait for Karn, I guess. And they're still not on four mana yet, so they don't have Mystic Snack. There it is, there's the Sinister Sabotage. Alright. I see Manipulator. Shoutouts to Old School Magic. That is an old school card. Alright. Let's do it. Karn, getting countered. I feel it. I feel this getting countered. Hey, there's Frilled Mystic. Mystic Snack. Mystic Snack. Alright. There's Mobilized District. We can try to jam Liliana. Um. Or we can try the Godfair. Let's do Godfair statue first. This makes it harder for them to respond to anything that I play in the future if they let this one go. There's Sinister Sabotage. Okay. All right. If this deck has a lot of counter magic, but it feels like we might be getting close. I think I would like to pull the trigger. Um. Yeah, let's do it. <clears throat> okay, well, I was red. And Ritual of Soot does not do the job here, unfortunately. Hmm. Alright, time to play cleanup, I guess. Karn feel about resolving. Okay, okay, okay. Hmm. Ritual of Soot. Destroy target wolf. <laughs> ah, you got me. Good game. You got me. Unsummon, man. Unsummon. Oh, okay, so I actually like the idea of damage being on the stack, and Unsummon can be is much better in Magic in the context of damage on the stack. So, <laughs> I I don't I dislike the card now, but it makes sense in this deck just as a nice little tempo card. It makes sense. You can't use one of your 400 counter spells on something that's already on the field. T1 Glycerol versus Equal. Alright, so this is Evangeline's little bracelet. This is, uh, it's actually my sister's, but she oh, was wearing it. So I'm gonna keep this. And. Um. Gonna talk about something else real quick. 
Uh, so we'll do Zalfur. No, 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 no. Reliquary Tower first, Zalfur and Void next turn, so that I can play Guild Globe and have better control over what I draw. Yeah, and the Reliquary Tower is probably just better as a swamp. I can't think of an instance when it's actually mattered. I don't think playing this deck it's ever actually mattered. Uh, in the colorless version of the deck, the one colored card being... Oh, okay, so we'll do Zalfur and Void. The one colored card being Joyra. Let's check the battlefield again. Um... Sh sure. Uh, you can actually draw a lot of cards because hers is when a historic when you cast a historic spell draw a card <clears throat> Discovery okay Grixis Drakes no 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 That would be cool, but no All right Swamp into Gleaming Barrier. Try to build up that black black. If we can lay an icy manipulator down next turn, we might have something going on. I don't think we can though. Icy manipulator into Karn shenanigans. Oh, they kept it on top. They kept it on top. What you got? Cast down. Yeah. Oh, okay. Treasure. I'm okay with that. Let's see. And there's our second black. So we'll do Zalfur and Void. See what we have. See what we're working with. Ooh. You know, two murders might be a bit excessive. I don't know. But I feel like it might be a little excessive. It's just a feeling. It's more than a feel. Okay. Uh, let's do Icy Manipulator. They only have one mana left? Yeah, now's, a, now's as good a time as any. We'd have to pop a treasure to do it now, though. Is that fine? That's fine. We'll pop a treasure. Oh, you better... Okay, good. Alright, unfortunately, they have entirely too much to deal with. <laughs> we'll shut down, uh, say... Uh... This. Pay the one, pop the treasure. This maybe doesn't do much, unfortunately. I'm hopefully stalling like a Kef nope, nope. Kef nope. Kef nope. Well, okay, so much for that then. Oh, okay, okay. Let me check their graveyard. Huh, I mean, it's Reanimator. Grixis Reanimator. I didn't pay attention to what the cards going in the the yard were initially as I should you know, I should have. Oops. Yeah. Yeah, that's on me. That's on me, folks. Well, okay. In that case. You know, there's probably a case for while they're tapped out getting a Karn down. That's not a bad idea. Yeah, let's do it. Should we just start laying the beats, folks? Um, well, the next turn is going to be Geode, so this is probably fine. Uh, we'll pass it right on. Oh, please, oh, please, oh, please, oh, please, oh, please, please work. Oh... Is there anything with double black in the deck? I, I unfortunately, I don't remember. All right, we'll say it's that one. In before Kefnet is a backup link on. All right, pass right on to main. We well, still got the mana for Bond. I'll be at a turn light. Okay. So I'm not... S wait, wait, it has, it has haste. Oh no, it has haste. That's right. 
Daggummit. This thing is haste. Daggummit. Okay. Well, this is on attack, so I'm no longer worried about it. Whenever it attacks. Or I could just murder it. I could just do that. Um, maybe I'm... No, 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 I'm not supposed to. So, we're gonna slow roll it a little bit. Mana Geode. Guild Globe is... Uh, we'll, we'll take the card it would have been. I don't have another card for which for that to matter. Uh, and then we can do Geode. Wait a minute. How much mana do I have open now? Four? Okay, then we'll do Geode and... We're, we're fine on mana. For, I think the rest of the game. Alright. Okay. Not gonna let you attack again, buddy. At least that's the... Okay. Okay. Well, that, that's fine. That's fine. We have Vraska's Contempt. It's not fine, but we're gonna pretend it's fine. Alright. Let's exile a guild globe. I mean, it could be worse. Somehow. It, it could be worse. Let's just do this now. Gain some life back, that totally matters. And we will pass the turn with uh, with murder up, too. Look at how many cards they have in hand. Uh, Reanimator is a deck. Reanimator is a real deck, folks. Let's see. Oh god, not again. Yeah, that resolves. Uh, we're gonna murder it here real quick. Alright. Yeah, each opponent discards a card. Ta-da! <laughs> okay, that resolves. This is such a good deck, folks. This is such a good deck. It really is. I could use another Manifold Key, or an Icy Manipulator. That would be nice. Uh-huh. That's good, too. Okay. We're... Actually, we're gonna draw a card. Gleaming Barrier. And we'll still have enough for Vraska's Contempt and an Icy Manipulator. So it could be a lot worse. It could be a lot worse, folks. That's pretty bad. That's pretty bad. Alright. So one, we're going to tap you down. Hello? Okay, there we go. And then two, when you draw a card, Nimbus at Perrin did one damage when a player casts an or sorcery to the Or draw, you draw a card. So it's effectively two one damage. Let's do this now. I'm going to gain two, lose one. And I just gave them a card. I don't want that to last any longer than it absolutely has to, though. The more cards they get off that, the worse. Now that's my last Raska's Contempt, though. So... Ooh, hey buddy, you looking nice, you looking nice, man. Oh my goodness. Now it's Grixis, so I, I suspect that they have stuff that they can do. I strongly suspect so, but I don't know. Bond of Insight, instant or sorceries. Alright, cool, that resolves. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, what is this crazy deck? Opponent... You know what? I sh I'll say hello as soon as they get done with their, uh... Hello? And their resolution. I clicked that, like, three times. Wada, wada, wada. 
Legion's End. Exile target creature an opponent controls with CMC 2 or less, and all of the creatures that player controls with the same name as the creature, then the player reveals their hand exiles. Okay. Uh, sure. That's an, that's interesting, I guess. Alright. Let it resolve. That was revealed, wasn't it? That was revealed in the hand. I should have responded with Icy Manipulator. That's on me. Alright, pass to my turn, make them discard. They're gonna discard whatever big monster they like. Cry of Carnaria. Okay. Fair. Fair. Fair and balanced. Uh, you know what? It's for a reward. We're just going to do it. Pass. It may be optimal to leave that in the hand, make the opponent think, hey, I might have something. Zero Fox given. Shoutouts to Melee Fox, my really bad Melee Fox. It's, eh, I mean, eh. it's bad. <laughs> By my standard, it's bad. I'm hard on myself, I admit. But I think it's bad. Bond of Revival's good. Alright, what you got? There is no way this thing is getting to attack. You know this. Ooh, my eyes. So the windows are open to let the cool air in, but the breeze is kind of drying my eyes out. Uh, maybe they got that jo Oh, Discovery, okay. Let me see what all is in their yard still. So anything I can take. Nicol Bolas. That's not enough. <gasps> Alright. What's in my graveyard? I have a Karn and a Karn. Um, uh, Karn's actually a clock. Let's do Karn. Hear me roar. Alright, this looks right. Make a Zamboni token. Alright, so I could get punished for this because they could have another creature and a bond and then I'd be in trouble, but we're gonna pretend that this is alright and pass the turn. The reason I could get punished is I only have one manipulator and no keys, no manifold keys. So I can only tap down one creature at a time. What I could have done instead is made them sack it. Oh my goodness. Yeah, that's a thing. Okay. So if they play another, I'm in a bit of trouble, perhaps. Bond of Insight. Okay. No, Mr. Bond, I expect you to die. <sighs> so it's not a workout, but it's better than doing nothing. Just, yeah, stretches, but also pushing against your hands. This isn't just like a like a prayer thing. This is pushing. Oh, no. Oh, no. I see what they did. I see what they did. They put a Vraska's Contempt in there. All right, Karn. Minus Karn. Since you're going down, you might as well do something. You might as well do something. Put you on a clock. Hello? I, hello? There we go. All right. Okay. Well, I mean, they're dead in a turn. Even if they exile, Vra yeah, Vraska's Contempt, exile. I still have exactly lethal on board. So, there's something else, though. And they haven't played a land, so land into bond. But they, they would have already played a land by now if they did. Land into bond into, like, bolus would be kind of hype. That'd be a thing. 
What you got, opponent? What you got? What do you... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's another Vraska's Contempt. Oh, no! Oh, no, folks. I, I didn't expect that because it took so long for them to deliberate. I really honestly didn't. Alright, so play the artifact just for more damage. Alright. Alright, let's see. It, sh it should be another bolus, right? That's, that's the only other thing in here, right? Right? Yeah, that's it. Uh, we'll end the turn. Oh no! Field of the Dead! Oh, I, that's right, I saw that in the yard earlier. Field of the Dead is a card. Okay, now we have a game, folks. Now we have a game. Field into Bond Bolus. Yep. Yep. Bolus is about to turn into a walker. Yes, I may discard a card. That is correct. Only creatures your opponent control. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Jeez. Okay. I still can't let you resolve, bud. I mean, attack. Okay, folks. Well, I mean, I guess there's a game. There's a game afoot. Alright, what do we have? Caves. It's just going to turn into another card anyway. Alright. Make them chump. Ooh, no, 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 they wouldn't have blocked anyway. I was about to say I could try to tap down, but it's not lethal. If it were lethal, yeah, that might be a thing. It's not, but it might be. Yeah, okay. Obvious chump is obvious. You have entirely too many lands for me to stop Bolus there. Alright, activate Bolus, and then I'm in trouble. And then I'm in trouble. 10 damage to target creature or planeswalker. Hmm. Oh no, you don't even have to do that. You don't even have to do that. Folks, I'm gonna go 3 here. If I hit my... No, I, I still haven't played enough lands yet, but once I play 40 lands, I'm switching decks. Shuffles their graveyard and oh no, oh no. Okay. Oh no, folks. Ripperoni. Uh huh. And that's only as a sorcery. Okay, whale, whale. That's a start. That's a start, at least. Alright, Karn, what can you get me? I could do Karn Meteor Golem, but I won't have enough- Oh! Okay, so Karn Meteor Golem, but I'm just shy on mana. Just shy. So... I'm sh just shy if I want to cast it this turn. I can get Meteor Golem anyway, and then Karn just dies next turn. Let's see. What else do we have, actually? Three Meteor Golems, and an Icy Manipulator in the side. Okay, Icy Manipulator's no longer great because one of them's going to turn into a Planeswalker. We'll get the M19 one, and, um... Hmm... Mm, I can try to take one hit, but if I use Meteor Golem on the Bolus... No, 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 we have to, we have to pass, because then I'm just going to lose the Meteor Golem. Is there a discard mode on this one? Okay. Whew! Yeah. Yeah, that resolves. You're good, dude, you're good. Dun, dun, dun! I mean, they have to know. T 
10 damage to target creature or planeswalker. Yeah, sorry, Karn. You did what you could. Let's uh, stop you from doing anything, please. Draw two cards. That's a thing, folks. That's a thing. Ladies and gentlemen, we again have a game, I guess. So, Meteor Golem, come in, hit the Nicol Bolas. And then pass. We're still not dead yet. Somehow, folks, we're still not dead. I don't know how. This is this is not a thing. Oh no. All right. Well, that's tough. That's tough. What can you do? Not a whole lot. Unfortunately, not a whole lot. That resolves. I guess we'll tap down you. Tap you down. Man, this is a good game. This is a good game. I don't care if I'm losing. This is a great game, folks. Alright, that hurts. I'm hurt, dog. Don't ask if I'm okay. Alright, Karn, do your thing again. Make a token, because Bolus is going to transform and kill you next turn anyway. And then we will... Do we just attack to make them use... Yes, we do. Yes, we do. Go to combat. Next to attackers. Yes. Alright, that's fair. That's to be expected. And we will end the turn. All right, search, transform. Oh, no, no, no! Oh, yeah, that's right. They shuffled their library back in. That's right. Oh, you're no fun. Where's the you're no fun emote? The you're no fun text. I'll say nice. Alright. Yeah, Karn's dead. Sorry, Karn. Alright. Tap you down. <sighs> too little, too late. Way too little, way too late. Holy crap, that is too late. <laughs> I mean, technically... Maybe we could still win, because they're cl they're at seven, and I don't know how many Vraska's... Well, Vraska's Contentment is back in the deck. Yay! Um, but that's probably not enough. Let's just go out on a limb and say it's probably not enough. All right, do you have to kill the Meteor Golem? No, they're going to they're gonna do it. They're going to do it. Okay, they might have another creature, though, or some other... Something that they... And that's a thing. That's right. They do have another creature. It's called you. It's called Zamboni. Alright. How do you feel about a four mana discovery? I know what I think of that. <sighs> Some of these cards. Discovery? Seems like. Oh, hasn't gone in yet. There it goes. Discovery to dispersal and dispersal would be really good with Fuse. <laughs> That's that's great. Let it resolve. Four mana charter course. That's that's definitely a standard card, right? All right. Let's tap you down again. Sorry, dude. Mobilized district. Okay. So. Uh. Huh. Yeah, they're at the point now. Yeah, we'll just do this. No, maybe I am... Sp it doesn't matter. They're going to block no matter what. So this is actually pointless, this uh, this whole thing. Uh, 
Okay. If they kill the meteor golem with Nicol Bolas, and somehow, somehow magically don't have a land, they do. They have Search for Iskanta. Transform. Yep. And that should trigger field, right? No, no, it does. That's right, it doesn't. Because it's already on the field. Alright, cool. Uh, well, never mind. We're done, skis. We're done, skis. I was hoping that they could. I would have Meteor Golem and Mobilize District. Nicol Bolas killed Meteor Golem. Mobilize District could still get through. Even if it's just for a little bit of damage. Yeah. What you got, opponent? What you debating with Bolas? The Arisen. He's even doing the cross pose. <laughs> the Arisen. You're the bad guy. You don't get to do that. Uh, uh. Sure. You may draw two cards. I have a crown. Evangeline would approve of this. Uh, does that do anything here? Minus two, minus two. Oh, oh, oh okay, okay. So it makes it where... Ah, I like it. Treasure. All right. Hello? Okay. All right, caves first, cave story. Just in case, you never know. All right, let's draw a card. Murder. Finally! Finally! <laughs> okay. Well. Hmm. Actually, look at the yard again. Yeah, no. Okay, fine. Combat. All right. I'm assuming double block. And then I'll murder one. They're not going to not draw lands. This is just stimming the this is stimming the bleeding. This is not enough. I could really use another manipulator or a key. That would be real nice right about now. Ten. Alright, we're getting entirely too close, folks. Square, if this doesn't work, I am absolutely just going to play another day. I'm just going to play Merfolk, play a three-minute game, win that three-minute game. <laughs> That's how it's going to work. Compare that to all the time working on this deck. Alright, well, what can you do? What can you do? Ooh. S stretch goals, folks. Stretch goals. I do yoga. I do yoga speedrunning. No, no, legitimately, I do yoga speed running. Okay, see what I have? Discovery again. Okay, cool. Ugh. Come on. What can I possibly get? While they're doing that, let me check out my, my yard. Karn, Karn, Lily. Ooh, okay, Ugin might be nice. Eugene would be cool. I could definitely do with Eugene here. He's in the deck somewhere. Or another land. That works too. Alright, we're getting we're cutting it entirely too close, folks. 
I need, uh, let's see, how many lands do I have? Five, six, this is about to get consolidated, so six, ten, thirteen mana. And thirteen mana is enough for Karn into Meteor Golem if I draw the other Karn the Great Creator. Yeah, there's only two in the deck because I haven't used the wild, wild cards yet. Hmm, okay. So Karn the Great Creator, Meteor Golem, kills the Bolas. I mean, I'm still going to take a huge hit from Drake. Dracuseth, but Drake. Um, yeah, I'd still be dead, wouldn't I? Okay, so Eugene would be nice. Eugene would be better. The reason I'd still be dead is... No, wait a minute. No, no, I have 13. That's right, I wouldn't be filled up. Karn plus Meteor Golem is 11. Wouldn't be filled up, giggity. And uh, I'd still have enough mana to use Icy Manipulator on Drake. Okay, so Karn, Eugene, Braska's Contempt, I think I've used two, right? Oh, that's right, I had two Lilies in the deck now. I think Braska's Contempt, one, two, yeah, of two. So that's not a thing, unfortunately. All right. Oh, actually, you know what? Murder would get me out of this, too. Another murder. Because I could murder one of them, tap the other down, and then swing with Mobilize District. And then Godfarer Statue for the win. Although they could have their own, too. Nope. Nope. Instead, this is going to be a thing. All right. Now, the text on your ult is... Check that out again. <laughs> but the bottom card of Target Player's Library. Good game. Yeah, you're not wrong. You're not wrong. If they ults... What? Okay, okay. No, I can't win. Well, well. Could I win? Could I win? I'm going to leave that on top. Please ult. Please let it be something good on the bottom. Please, for the love of all things good and holy. Please, I beg of thee, let it be, dear lord, let it be. Alright, let's do this. Here comes a whole lot of blocked damage. Combat. Go to attackers. Double block. Oh, no! No! You got me. I should have just floated colorless, but whatever, it doesn't matter. You got me. You got me good there. Oh, uh, okay. I don't care that I'm dead. Oh, jeez. I'm gonna let them play it out. Let, I'm gonna let you have your fun. Yeah. Do it. Yes, do it. Okay, what do we have? What's the last one? Okay, I saw Ugin be... Ugin, Ugin doesn't save me anyway. Oh. Nice! Nice! <laughs> I like it. We're gonna be cheeky. Is there any point in me being cheeky here? Yeah, I'll concede after I tap it down. I'll tap it down first. Just because they spam good gang, I guess. <laughs> yeah, good game. You got me. That was grueling. Boom. They didn't even bother attacking. That's cool. That's cool. Alright, folks. Well, enough of that silliness. Alright, we still haven't gotten the other. 26? That's all? Okay, uh... Hello, merfolk. Hello, merfolk. I may take a little bit of a break, actually, uh, after this game. After I get just a win with merfolk. You know, at least with Merfolk, the games are over quickly. They're either over quickly, or they're over quickly. You know when you've lost. Usually. Usually. That that mud game earlier for game one, that, I guess, would kind of be an exception, maybe. But they saw their hand, they knew. Artificer. T1 Glycerol versus Artificer. Okay, so the mud deck, right, as soon as I switch off the mud deck, this is what we get. Uh, sure, why not? So one, two, three, and a three. This is fine as, you know... Downside, I can't play Kumin on turn one, but we'll make it work. We'll make it happen. <laughs> yep, 
Yeah, and also my opponent goes first, so maybe I'll get a forest or a breeding pool. Maybe, or an unclaimed territory. That'd be nice. Hey. The opponent goes first, 20 minutes from now. Alright, what you got? Forest, okay, cool. Uh, we'll just play an island, pretend that we have opt in our deck, and pass the turn. Ooh. There we go. Healer's Hawk. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh no. I don't like this deck. This is an oh no 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 deck. Uh, well, they didn't play uh, planes already, so I'm gonna hope, I'm gonna cross my fingers that there's not an John. Okay, okay. No Johnny Pride Mate. Instead, we have Enchantress. Oh, next turn, upkeep. Trickster. Let's go. Hello? Let's go to damage. Cool. 19 all. Uh, in turn. I feel like I have to smack the button to make it do its thing. Alright. Are there any flash enchantments I should care about? Now that Stasis Snare is not in standard. It's been a hot minute, but I I like that card. I don't know. Fair and balanced magic. Fair and balanced magic the gathering. In fact, fair and balanced. <laughs> Alright. Ooh, gah. Well, that's a that's a card. That's a card, folks. Do it now. Hey, everybody, you get to attack. Alright. Hinterland Harbor. I guess I should have... I should have done the Branch Walker first, to be fair. Ooh! Naughty! Oh, well, uh... Still get to draw some cards. Alright. Let's see. What do we have? Seal away. That's a thing. That's a card. That's a good card. Hmm. Enchantress is fun. Whack. Whack, whack, whack. Waka, 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 waka. Alright. Branch Walker first. Breeding pool. We're still gonna do the Mist Binder. We read this just to make sure. Hmm. Yeah, so Kapala only cares about activated abilities. Uh, sure. Let's do it now. All right. They're not dead yet. And that's a little concerning. They're about to just go on a card draw spree. Now they've been stuck on lands. I imagine that's about to change, but... Alright. Plus two plus... Did I see plus two plus two for two mana? Yeah, I did. Sure did. Give it lifelink. No. Oh no! I, I can't even see what that is! <laughs> plus one plus one and has reach? Trample. Huh. Huh. Alright. So. Biggest creatures get blocked. Three. Six. I, I still have him, don't I? You see. They block the biggest creatures. Still gonna take eight. Am I missing something? I feel like I must be. No, they're tapped out. Okay. I'm not that bad at math, am I? <laughs> Alright. 
a good game. See, that's it. Just play Merfolk. That's all you have to do. Just, just play Merfolk. Merfolk? It's a good deck. It's alright. I like to think it's okay. Shout us to Nikachu. Alright. Uh, did we get there? 31. You know what? I'm still gonna take a break. I'm sorry. I have been drinking entirely too much water because I haven't been feeling well. Been taking care of a sick baby, so... You know. But I'll live. Don't worry. I'm fine. Um, but that means I gotta go. I gotta take a break. So I'll be back in just a bit. Alright, and I'm back. And you know what I forgot? I forgot I was supposed to open some packs for you, so I have 3,150. Let's open some packs. I was supposed to do that after game one. That was game four, so let's let's speed it up, Jay. Come on. All right. Waiting for the server? Hey. Waiting. 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 <laughs> there goes my voice. Waiting. I, I, I. All right, so we're going to do three War of the Spark. Packs. Because I'm looking for Karn and Ugin and a few other seemingly miscellaneous cards um, that happen to be in war. Wish I'd opened more of these earlier, so let's see what we have. Alright. Alright, uh, what's it gonna be? I mean, two wild cards is fine. None of these actually. Well, Jaya's is fine, but alright. Roll reversal. Uh, that's a fun commander card. But, not what I'm looking for here. Alright, what do we have? Come on! Come on! Firemind Vessel again? Huh. Okay. And... Hello? There it goes. Ooh, Bolus of Citadel. That's a card. It's not what I'm looking for, but it's a card. Alright, last one. Poatli Elite Guard Mage? Okay. Hmm. Well. Let's see. Alright. Did I get it? God Eternal Oketra. Number two, I think. And that's a really good card, but none of them happen to be what I, would have, what I was looking for. Alright, so let's go back to the home for a sec. Alright. I have 150 coins. When I get this, I'll have 750 more, that'll put me at 900, one more win, and I'll have a thousand. That's enough for a pack, and if I don't get what I need from there, which to be fair, I'm definitely not going to get all of what I need, then I guess I will... I guess I'll just open one more. Or, uh, no, no, not open one more. I'll use some wild cards. This will be after I will have opened one more. Uh, you know what? We'll just play Merfolk a couple more times. Or, I guess I could play Drakes. Uh, I like to jam Merfolk while I can. Drakes I'll have come next standard. Drakes doesn't actually change that much at all. Um, but, lo and behold, I mean, it, it does. I lose, like, Enigma Drake. I lose Chart, of course. Cards like that. But, I'll, it still feel, it'll still feel like the same deck. Merfolk will not. Bacchus Boy. Bacchus Boy. Alright. Whale. Let's see. I'll keep. I'll keep this hand. What do we have? A Storm Tamer. Flyers. I'm going with this one. That one gets to be it. Alright. Well... Let's see. Taking the one. What else do you have? Supreme Phantom. Spirits? Okay. You're cool. You're cool. Uh, well, I'm not going to be able to hit through with anything anyway, so maybe I just go speaker, speaker. Yeah, no, let's, let's, uh... Yeah, no, it's, it's not going to make a difference. There you are, Eagle. I knew you'd show up. Yeah, this is a problem. This is a problem, folks. It is a spirit, too. I had forgotten that. Unfortunately. Hmm, folks. Hmm. What I would do for a water trap weaver. 
That would be a thing. It's not a water trap, Weaver. No attacks. Well, I mean, we're working towards the land, so... Even if I lose this game, it's... Oh, even if. As if that's an if now. <laughs> no, that's what's happening. That's what's happening, folks. <laughs> no! Alright, so, uh, Eagle, by the way, if I ever do, uh... Spirits? Let's, see, let's reveal the merfolk. We'll reveal Silvergill. Because why not? Play it. Say good game. Say good game first. Because it was. It was. Um, Spirits is in my vintage gauntlet. It's this box that's under the bed with, uh, yeah, uh, behind the scenes with T1 Glistenroth. This is a bed. Uh, it has a Spirits deck, and it's rocking right now Supreme Phantom. Um, the three mana lord that's the one that gives hexproof to others, uh, spirits you control. And then I might just add that guy because they all, no, 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 they don't all have flying. Well, well, all but two have flying, so maybe that's still worth it. Probably not though, right? Um, it's a three four, well, it's a two three as opposed to a two two, but hexproof is probably a little bit better. Just a little bit. Uh, never mind, ignore that. Alright, still need one more win. One more win would be nice. Just a little bit. I wouldn't say no to that. Ooh. Ooh. So much stretching. There's a bed back here, so I want to get my arm further. Versus Reset. I've played you, or at least I've seen that name. Enough times that I remember. Okay. I'll go first? Sure. Alright, what do you say? I'm back with more water, by the way. Water. Water Trap Weaver. Without knowing what I'm up against just yet, I think Water Trap's probably fine. Often it's fine. Huh. I wonder what I was going to draw. Do Branch Walker first for the breeding pool. Oracle. Yes. Even though I don't have the lands for it yet, I have another land and two Jade Light Rangers. I suspect that I'll get there. Okay. Life gain. Life gain that did not find the one mana enchantment. A Johnny's Welcoming or something like that. Yep. Baffling End. Huh. Okay. Nice. I mean, you do what you have to do. Mono white control. Mono white control. <sighs> okay. Um. Sh sure. Okay, that's more than fair. So, I can try to trap it first, just to push some damage through. I mean, if I play Seafloor Oracle, they're just going to block anyway. I don't know that I feel like trading a 2-2 flyer for a 3-2. I don't know how I feel about that. Water Trap Weaver into Griffin... I'm going to play that anyway, so I'll play it now. Why not? Attack for three, and then Oracle. Even if they put up a wall of creatures, I should still be able to get through with at least some. Um, that said, I don't know. We'll see. <sighs> Take Vengeance, yeah. Oh, okay, this maybe is just like a budget list. Like one of the starters you get. That has to be it, right? Okay. Well, I mean... Have at thee. 
Just on creatures, I'll trade one for one, plus I'll get to draw a card. What you got? So Tempest Caller is kind of... I mean, it depends on the matchup, sure, but often Tempest Caller is just excellent. This is an excellent card. Shoutouts to, to Michael for getting Tempest Caller three games in a row and be not... Like, just being a really good sport about it. <laughs> he played three creature decks in a row against me, and every game ended in Tempest Caller, even when the last one was technically superfluous. I didn't have to, I just, I just did. <laughs> Yay, card draw, woo! Alright. Oh, yeah. Yeah, let's, uh, let's play land. Why not? If we get one more land, we can do double Jade Light Ranger. Never mind, there's a Sarah Angel. We're gonna play a Tempest Caller. I think. Never mind. Never mind again. Water Trap Weaver time. Take that. Alright, draw a couple, find a land. And there's a land. I I'm tempted to say something random, but I. I. Nah. Why? <laughs> uh. Unclaimed territory naming ape. Ooh, that's a thing. That's definitely a thing. So, the uh, gatherer ruling, one of them on Jade Light Ranger, is something to the effect of if you can explore twice, uh, you will see the same card if you keep it on top. Try to act surprised. <laughs> it's great. It's great. Okay. So, obviously, they're holding up a trade here. I'm going to put this on upkeep just so I don't forget. I would like to attack first. Make that offer. Which they will promptly take. And while they're debating that... I do rather like the idea behind Mono White Control. Yeah, send him right on to damage. Uh, we'll go... Jade Light Ranger. Mr. Ranger, sir. And find two lands, because of course. In that case, I guess we'll also do a Branch Walker, since we have the mana open. For Trickster as well. Oh god. Oh god. Let's just have all the things. Yeah, I'm sorry, opponent. That's That sucks. That kind of sucks. Okay. Whale. 850 plus a pack. Cool. Hadn't been doing too well. Only two for the day so far. So we'll go to the store and buy some more. Wait for the server. Because of course... I have no idea how many times I almost clicked on the M21. But no, we're taking war. Alright. I'll do 20 first. We'll see, we'll see. Alright. What is Diamond Knight? Choose a color. Oh, okay. Neat. If that worked for colorless, that'd be, that'd be fun. Yay for having Brainstorm! No, 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 you're not Brainstorm. You're not Brainstorm. <laughs> okay, never mind. Yarok. Ooh. That's a sound. That's a sound and a half, folks. Alright, what do we get this time? Alright. Well, I mean... Sure. Hi, Tibble. I, I dislike Tibble. Poor guy. Poor guy. <laughs> oh, excuse me. <laughs> the Lost. <laughs> The Lost is an okay card. I, I run in Animar, and that's, that's okay. It's like an extra Elvish Visionary. Uh, but sadly, not quite what I was looking for. So let's go to the decks. And uh, we'll do uh, Eeny, Meeny, Miny. I think this is the one that I'll, I'll run first against him. Uh, this is the one with the 
easiest changes, perhaps. Perhaps. So Arclane and Arc Arclane. Ugh. Arcane Encyclopedia, God, why, is uh, probably an easy out. I will say that Power Stone Shard, despite doing work the last time that I was on here, uh, is not necessary. Um, it makes more mana than Mana Geode, but it doesn't scry, and after a certain point, like, I don't have a Mana Sink. It's in the deck, in it, not in the red version or the black version, because you have Joyra, which can let you draw through your deck, but that's just a one of. So Power Stone Shard, uh, maybe not. Maybe, maybe that's going to go. But first, let's look at the cards we are definitely adding in. So we're going to add a uh, Karn. At least one Karn. Let's see how many rares we have. Four rares. Okay. Karn. Ugin. Karn. I'm tempted to do Karn, Ugin, Karn. And... Um, we don't have to ha do another one. We can wait. Karn, Ugin, Karn, Ugin. Wouldn't be bad. But we're definitely doing these two, so we'll, we'll craft those. Now, I have to take stuff out. So, taking up four Power Stone Shards and putting in four Planeswalkers, that, that'll do something to your curve. But on the other hand, one of the weaknesses to a deck like this, and this is true for mud decks, basically across formats, so including like Legacy, for instance, is that you can run out of gas and just be drawing air. You can have your means and run out of ends, especially if your ends get countered, which there is a flash counter deck in the, in the format right now. Uh, this is true for Tron in Modern. Like, if you can counter one or two cards from Tron, the payoff cards, they might not... No, no, granted, this is that's a weird example because Ugin doesn't care whether it resolves, but like... Karn Liberated, uh, not Ugin, um, Ulamog. Ugin cares. Ulamog does not. Uh, Worm Coil Engine, things like that. Uh, then you can just leave them drawing lands and bad stuff like that. So, uh, this is running two God Pharaoh statue, which is probably one too many, because there's one in the main, or there's two in the main, one in the side. There has to be one in the side because of Karn. So, uh, hmm, folks. Um, I can't believe I haven't tr gotten another one. I got two Karns as my first two War of the Spark packs. My first two. I got an Ugin not too terribly long afterwards. And, uh, alright. Let's see. Power Stone Shard. Probably is probably is where it's at. Um, I can take out some number of geodes and leave four Power Stone Shards in. Keys, Manifold Key plus Power Stone Shard is a combo. But I think I prefer the scry- oh man. Oh man, this is tough. This is tough. This is so tough. One, two, three, four. I'm gonna do it. I'm going to operate under the assumption that I don't need that much mana most of the time, which most of the time is true. Exceptions being Joyra, Mystic Forge, um... The mana base is weird. The mana base is really stinking weird. This is not at all how it's going to end up. Uh, Joyra is here because I have one, and she's good in the context of an artifact deck, I, but I could take her or leave her. Uh, but she's good. She's good. So now we are at 58 cards, may want to add something else in. So Arcane Encyclopedia combos with Manifold Key, yes. Uh, it's just a weird way to draw more than one card a turn. Um, it's it's not staying in the end. But again, it helps you to draw you through the air in your deck. Uh, but if I'm going to add more cards in, probably the last Karn will craft that. It's going to be a thing anyway. And I'm tempted to do an Ugin. Um, and take out a God Pharaoh statue and add something else back in. This is a really high curve deck. You know what? If I'm going to be running... Why are there two fountains? Oh, just to hold me over. Just to keep me alive. So four gleaming barriers. Yeah, I might have to keep the power worn shards in, actually. Take out a God Pharaoh statue. I might have to. Uh, just to keep myself alive against, like, the 
the Boros, the Feather decks, or just anything that's aggro at this point. This is not a real deck, this is for a jank brew-off, and I'll be running a version of this in Historic and Come Next Standard. So, I, I'm okay with making some of these commitments, but, you know, Gleaming Barrier is not enough to hold off all these decks. Um, you just, the deck is assuming I'm going to survive. And, I mean, I will survive, as long as I know how to la da 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 Okay. Okay, let's see. Nothing like a 2-1 to keep you alive. Nothing like a, a Prismite to keep you alive. Oh, folks. Volta- oh, you know what? Voltaic Servant is a 1-3 that actually synergizes with some of the stuff in this deck. That can help to keep me in the game. So we'll put you in... Um, hmm, folks, hmm. Oh, boy. I'm thinking, I'm thinking. I'm a-thinking. So I could take out two fountains, and something else. I need to take out one more card, and then I could put the power sworn, power worn sh shards, power, power worn stones back in. Let's do that now. Hello, right here. Now, you don't have to be in the main board, Servant, but you're there to keep me alive. And you do have utility later on. Things like Encyclopedia, but mostly Manifold Key, which doesn't need to be a three of. Uh, it synergizes with a lot of the decks, so we'll take out two fountains. It's life gain and it draws me a card. Um, later on, much later on. And then there's one more card that I would have to take out here. And the deck is running 24 lands, as I recall. It's running a really weird mana base. Like, a really stinking weird mana base. Like, these things don't even... Ah, uh, these don't even have to be here. Like, check this out. And let's say, uh, one, two, three, hello? Hello? One, two, three. One, two, three. And I'm at 60. Now, now, how many lands is this? 7, 13, 17, 18, 19, 23. 23 with a high curve deck like this seems low, to be honest. Uh, we have Gleaming Barrier sometimes ramps you, some not. Guild Globe draws, uh, or Encyclopedia draws, Geode Scries. Zelfrin Void Scries, Power Stone is Ramp. I, th I think I can get away with this. This looks so wrong, and that's because it is. And if I can't cast the Joyra because I didn't draw the right lands, Joyra's in there experimentally anyway. Like, I, I will eventually take her out for another Ugin. Which I may do now, but nope, nope. You know what, I think I'll do that later on against, uh, against uh, Michael. I'll do that like between games, maybe just swap out the Joyra for an Ugin. But uh, now, save the changes, save and exit, cool, and let's go into the others and fix them on up too. Now they don't have powers worn shard, power stone shards, power, power worn stones, stones, whatever, because these are running uh, actual interaction early in the game, Shiv and Fire and Lightning Strike in this case. Now, again we'll do this, and I already have only one Godfarer statue here, so finding the room here might be a little bit trickier. Once again, I can go down to just 23, and that's maybe alright. 23 lands, those mas, and Sylvan Fire is the worst removal spell, but I don't necessarily need something that points at the opponent's face. Often I need something turn one to deal with the Llanowar Elves. Uh, but, but, uh, is that better than everything else that I have go- No, no, you do still have Power Stone Shard. Oh, okay, I had forgotten about that. Hmm. Okay. Okay, folks. Well. In that case, I'm gonna maybe do something a little different. 
I can take out shard and put in more removal. I think that's fine. For what the deck is trying to do, not having as much ramp is fine when the de deck is less top heavy and has more interaction low to the ground to deal with creatures early on. I think that's okay. I think. Maybe wrong. I think so. Alright. And we'll deal with this sideboard later, whatever. Whatever the sideboard. And then last but not least, Karn Mud Black. Which also is interaction, albeit only one cast down because I have one to my name. See, so yeah, check this out. Only one. A murder. 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 Alright. Cool. Shoutouts to Death Clock. Alright, now this deck already has a really high curve. This is about to just become Planeswalker control if I'm not careful. The Eldest Reborn is removal. Um, and it is a win condition, but with this many Planeswalkers, unless I'm up against like the Immortal Sun, I don't think I'm too worried about having to have the Eldest Reborn. It is removal though, in a deck that doesn't have much removal otherwise. Um, but I think that's okay. I'll take out two, plus it's five mana removal too. But, it's a ramp deck that can get it as soon as turn four. I mean, yeah. Um, there's only one key. Others in the sideboard. Let's see. Can't really take out Ritual, I think. I think. Yeah, we'll take out the Eldest Reborn. By that stage in the game, uh, it's fine. It's fine. All right. So, then, one more. One more to go. And... I don't know... Oh, that's right, that's right. We're going to 23 lands in all the versions of the deck. That's right, so now I guess we're set to go. So, uh, yeah. Also, shoutouts to Chandra's Blaze. And I'm gonna... I'll play one more. I'll play one more. I'll play this one again. Let's get a sneak preview of how it's going to work, which is to say, poorly. Oh, wait, 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 what am I doing? Hello, that's what I meant to do. Play it. No, I never would have known that. Alright, no, it's fine. It's fine. Ready. Round six. Fight. Fishman. When I see long numbers like that, I wonder what the sentimentality, if there is any, happens to be. Uh, we'll keep this. We'll keep this hand. Hi, Void. Uh huh. Save it for a Guild Globe. And we'll do Island Hold Full Control for Opt, that we totally have in this deck. In turn. Hello? I said, hey, there we go. Pass. What? Aha! Okay, this is, this is a lot of, rip my space bar. Incubation Druid is not good, but we're going to pretend it is. We're gonna we're gonna stop doing that now. <laughs> yes, we'll draw. We're gonna stop that. That seems annoying. Okay, so yet another land. I'm gonna shove that to the bottom. It's great late game, but I don't think this is a late game deck. So we're gonna go globe. See what we draw. It's a servant. Okay. Servant key. That's a thing. Servant Key is, uh... That's a barrel of monkeys. Growth Spiral, okay. I haven't seen Nexus in a hot minute. Not that that's necessarily what this is. Okay. Huh. We'll play the mountain. I guess I should do Geode instead, right? Geode, then key. Put that to the bottom. Geode, key. Let's do it. Alright. 
So we have a lot of air. A 1-3 is not enough. Adapt. Okay, never mind. We'll get there. They'll get there. Alright. Reliquary Tower? We'll scry again. Please draw us something. An actual spell, please. That's an actual spell. Thank you, Richard Garfield. Uh huh. We'll do. I mean, the barrier's just gonna die. It's just going to die. And then I'll be able to cast next turn if it resolves. If, which is a big if, if it resolves, I will be able to uh, play the key, the servant and the barrier for free. If Ugin will resolve, yes, that adapts. I have a. You have a three five. I have an O four. Hopefully, they'll just bounce off each other. I suspect you didn't adapt it to have a 3-5, though. I have a deep and abiding suspicion that's not why we did it. That's why we did it. Hmm, well, that's a thing, folks. Well, the good news, Ugin's resolving. Bad news, Ugin's dying after that. Hey, there we go. Free? Free? I'll take free. Free is good. Okay. Let's see. I'm trying to think, what is Voltaic Servant going to untap? Does it matter? Like, it, it just, it's just going to be the Geo. There's no other tricks I can do, right? Alright, so, uh, block, block, just do that. And, no, 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 that's a 1-3, that's a 1-1, one, one. never mind. Jay, you genius. You genius. We got there. Uh-oh. Oh, they're just reading, maybe. Just reading. What is this? E oh, no. Oh, no. Well, rip me. Rip me. You know, if I'm going to be... No, there's too much blue mana. Huh. I was thinking I might be able to run something like that myself. By the way, that art, that's a pretty decent, pretty decent art, right? Alright. Gonna untap the barrier. Yeah, you will. Yeah, you will. Okay, well, um... First we draw. Then we draw some more, I'm sure. Hey, got there. Hmm. And I guess we'll save it, but uh, this game's over. This game's over. Why am I still playing? I mean, I guess Ugin can't do his minus. I mean, not just because he's at two, I have no permanence for Ugin to hit. That's kind of neat. That's kind of cool. We're going to draw a card first. Gonna say good game. You got me. You got me. Hey, that that one card. I thought I was doing okay, but when you have that much mana, whoo, whoo. Speaking of, maybe the blue version of this deck ought to run that card. Just maybe. That seems like it might be all right. All right, we'll try again. We'll try again. You can't. I can't threaten me with a good time. I love this game. I love this... Eh, I don't know if I love this deck. That's maybe too strong a word, but it's alright. It's okay. 
It's okay. No, let me see if it'll let me cancel. Oh, it did that time. It didn't earlier. Uh, let's do... Not that one. Let's do... Oh, Red Mud. Red Mud's fine. So I live in Georgia, and our, we have red clay. It's close enough. All the iron in it. All the iron in the dirt. In the dirt. I can make that joke. I'm from the south. It, it takes some. It takes an effort for self-deprecation to not be okay. All right. Let's see. Not gonna do anything on the first turn, so memorial down. Yeah, fire and strike. Okay. Fair enough. Uh, I'm tempted to save it, but. Uh, it's okay. We'll do it now. There's also, I think, a slight case. No, no, it's fine. It's fine. The opponent doesn't know what we're on yet. If they do, I will be shocked. Shocked, I tell you. And we'll play a barrier and pass. Alright, if I could listen to my opponent's stream, Almond's Ant's stream, and try to figure out their thought process going through, what on earth is my opponent doing? This is land destruction. Okay, I guess seeing Memorial to War, I guess that'd be my first thought. Is this land destruction? And why am I playing against Jay? Of course it's land destruction, right? Land destruction is one of those archetypes I always, 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 always try to make a thing in Standard. It's often not a thing. It often can't be a thing. Uh, and it definitely can't while well Risen Reef is in Standard, so rip land destruction for a while. You know, but Crucible Memorial to War before Risen Reef? That could have been a thing. Alright. This, this is not resolving. I will be shocked if this resolves. Sabotage. But better... Negate? Okay. Better that eat it than Karn. Hopefully the Merfolk Tricksters are just sitting there waiting. Oh. Neat art. Oh. Hi, bug. It's just a random bug that decided it wanted to join me. I'm gonna... I'm just gonna try this out. Snack. Do snack. Eh, yeah. okay. That's not good. Folks, that's really not good. I can strike one of them. I'll strike. I can. Ooh, okay. Uh huh. Jeez. Yeah, this seems like a matchup where removal is okay. Uh, crap. Crap. I hate this thing already. All right. So next turn, I'll be able to shiv and fire. In the meantime, I can strike the token. So. Plus one, plus one to other wolves and werewolves, and then at the beginning of your end step, if you didn't cast a spell, make a two-two. Yeah. Okay. Gonna attack. Gee, I wonder why. Uh, you know what? It's probably okay here, right? It's probably okay to block, and make a treasure. I can maybe use that mana going forward. And I'll still have an artifact for Karn Scion. I mean. I put that one in my deck for a reason. Alright, what you got? That resolves. Kill it with lightning. Counter. You have a counter, I'm sure. I feel it. I feel it. Next turn, Shiv and Fire, if it doesn't work, we'll have Strike Strike, and we'll try to get him there. Like, they, they have something. That delay, there's a reason for that. That's a sign. I mean, how many creatures are there? And Mystic Snick. Show me Mystic Snick. I will never say its name correctly. What you got? 
No, 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 just syncopate. X equals 2. Ah, oh, so close. So close. Yeah, that resolves. Alas. So close. No, 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 we weren't. Look at that. Two extra lands. What am I saying? Of course we weren't. Never mind. Never mind. Alright. Ambusher's a problem. If I can deal with Ambusher, the wolves get debuffed, and then Karn can make tokens big enough to deal with the rest. Alright, there's the trigger. Why do you have flash, by the way? Why does this thing have flash? This abomination before God. Why does it have flash? It doesn't feel like it should have... I, I guess it's an ambusher. That counts as flashing. Alright. Alright. This is not resolving. Is it? Nope. <sighs> We're not dead yet. We're not dead yet. Yeah, unsummon in the context of a deck where your creatures get to do things like that. It's it's okay. It's an alright card. You know what? We're just gonna call it here. Actually, we're just gonna call it. I got outplayed. I was outplayed. I should just play an actual deck. I instead of trying to force this thing through, I should just play an actual deck. But you know what? I'm not gonna get to play with this version of it in just a little bit, in just a few months. So let's uh let's play it while we can, I guess. Alright. Stretchy time. You know what? My arms can reach both sides. Uh, oh no, I'm gonna break this. Let's not do that. Actually, let's not do that. Too soon. Alright. Yeah, I could just not draw lands. That that could happen. But I have something to do early in the game. <sighs> Let's see. Alright. Pretend it's shock. And pass the turn. Fountain. Okay. Fountain's fine. Bring it on. Alright, so we did get somewhere. Uh, barrier. Barrier. Might as well play the card. 21. 19. Never mind. Alright. Obvious negate is obvious. Still, gonna play it. You have a counter spell. You have a counter spell. Bill, 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 Bill. Alright. Alright, let it be. I think we're probably okay where we are. Probably. I don't know. I don't know. <clears throat> There's uh, an anticipate. Okay, never mind. Oh, okay. Okay. Back to twenty. It's a tie. That's totally how ties work. Saw so, uh, a game where Ross Merriam was at twenty and Reed Duke was at one, and Reed Duke was winning. All right. I should get on to the flash deck. Flash seems like a fun mechanic. To have in standard, especially. Okay, see what it is this time. Once again, I think with two fires we're okay. And then we'll pass. See if we can get the ball rolling anytime soon. Anytime would be nice. Gift of Paradise. Okay. Maybe I don't have a clue what this deck is. But, uh... 
I hit. Okay, there we go. If I draw a land, this Godfarer statue is going to try to get some work done. I'm gonna try. That's a land. We're just gonna scry every turn, by the way. Manifold Key, uh, I don't have anything to use it on just yet, but I think that's okay. I think it's alright. So this is gonna make it one additional mana? Yeah, a two mana. Okay, the, the land has tap add two. So they have four minus two. Guild Globe. Oh, please tell me you're doing what I'm doing. Only sillier. <laughs> Only sillier. Yeah. Alright. Let's just start laying the beats down. And we still have Shiv and Fire up. Yes, we do. Hey, I love the fountain. The one mana artifact and the six mana ar artifact are just staring each other down here. He's touching me. No, I'm not. Okay. Uh, the ramp deck getting stuffed by God Pharaoh's statue. I assume. I, I have no idea, maybe, what's going on here. It seems like you'd want to make a giant hydroid crisis, and that's what's happening. There's a ley line. Okay. He's a biggin'. Let's actually... Let's do this. Ah, uh, oh well. Oh, well. Go to combat. Hit you for a bunch. It's a very technical magic term, a bunch. Alright. That's such a satisfying crunch when that happens. So they're at 16, then they're at 17. Uh, I can deal 14, and then 15 from the God Pharaoh statue. So if I can get one more artifact and they can't do anything, then I win. And Karn, conveniently enough, can draw me a card. And Cryptic Caves can also... And there's a Bag of Holding, so I think that's... I won't say good game yet, because you never know. They might have something. Okay. Let's see. A land or a land? Well, I mean... Yeah. I guess. I guess. Uh, let's do bag they had to think so there's there's something All right, we'll go to combat and we'll try to do it now we'll do it now we'll, no, let's do it live we'll do it live all right what you got I'm gonna flash something in the block roots ah uh... I like this. <laughs> Turbo Fog is another one of those decks that I try to make in every format. I love this. I love this game so much. Ooh, okay. I mean, not that it matters much now, but yeah. Uh, so how many cards do I have in the deck? 42. <laughs> We're a ways away. Your go. What? <laughs> I mean, I have plays, maybe. Should I, should I, no, let's not do it back. Let's not, let's be nice. Let's be nice, folks. No, 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 now we're gonna start doing it. We're gonna start doing it. Uh, huh. They might have something that gains life. Okay, this is a, a tilt attempt. I like it. I'm gonna I'm gonna do everything but. I'm gonna do every single thing but. Come on. This is this is fun. I love this game. Do it. Like you you have it. You definitely have another one. Yes. Alright. 
and uh, proceed to damage, all zero damage. And then we will, how much mana do we have left? One, two, three? I will pass the turn. That's fine. Just remember to do Bag of Holding later. Now that I know that the Shiv and Fires are eh, not going to be things, they're not going to matter. You know, I'm, there's a case maybe to not do Bag of Hold. Oh, okay, I got there, got there. Because if it's a Turbo Fog deck, you may want to keep cards in your deck, keep cards in your library. Um. Okay, well that was fun. That was fun. I found Turbo Fog again. I'm happy. Uh, my life is complete. That was cool. And I'm gonna end it on that. That's it, Magic Community. Take care, and I will see you all later. And again, if you need any cards from TCG Player, I have an affiliate link down in the description. It really does actually help the channel, like tangibly helps the channel. So if you don't mind, go right on there. Uh, shout out to Team Etherhub for having me, and I will see you all later. Bye-bye.